Hi, I'm Tim and welcome to this new video series which is going to be about Alta Labs where I'm going to be doing a full network setup series using Alta Labs gear. Now Alta Labs have kindly sent me some boxes so you might want to know what's inside these boxes here. Well, let's take a look inside the boxes and see what we have. Firstly, we have this, the Alta Labs Route 10 10 gigabit router which features four 2.5 gigabit ethernet ports, two of which are PoE plus, and we also have two SFP plus ports, which are rated at one gigabit, 2.5 gigabit, five gigabit, and 10 gigabit speeds. We also have in the box, which is the Alta Labs Control on-premise network controller, which is powered by the PoE plus port here and optionally at the back we have a USB connection where you can purchase a standard USB-C adapter to power it should you so wish and if you don't want to use PoE plus however I'm going to be using the PoE plus port and connect this to the Alta Labs Route 10 PoE plus port on it and we also have this which is the S8 PoE 8 port gigabit network switch which features four PoE plus ports. And finally we have this which is the Alta Labs AP6 Outdoor Pro access point which features one gigabit weatherproof RJ45 connector in this grommet. I'm really looking forward to bringing you this video series so a big thank you to Alta Labs for sending these products out to me for testing, review, and so I can show you what their products can do. So keep a lookout for upcoming episodes in this series, and hopefully you'll find these videos useful where we'll be setting up the router, controller, adding a switch, adding an access point, setting up VLANs, and so on. As more features are added to the new controller software and firmware releases, We'll also be going through those facilities in upcoming videos. So hope you like this series. And in this series, by the way, we'll be setting up the network using a wired network connection. Now you can do it via Bluetooth, should you so wish. However, Alta Labs have done a great job of releasing instructional videos on how to set it up by Bluetooth. So in this series, we won't be using Bluetooth, but we'll be doing it via a network connection. So that's it for now. Take care. Back again soon. Bye for now.